the 2005 Jordan Alexander Valley Cabernet. 2005 vintage was a, a wonderful vintage. What you want in a wonderful growing season is moderate temperatures. And 05 was a, a wonderful season for that. To say what was different about the 2005 and 2004, really, or 2003, or any of the vintages we produce, certainly there is, is a uniqueness to each vintage, but uh, what I really focus on is consistency. We use a little bit more French oak than we do the American oak on that vintage, and, and, and normally we're looking at two-thirds French oak. Certainly that we have a little bit more Petit Verdot. Petit Verdot has just been phenomenal addition for us. Blueberries, this beautiful violet color, but also uh, soft round tannins that work well uh, as an addition to the Merlot and then the Cabernet Sauvignon we have. The 2005 has even more cassis-like characteristics. That really is what that fruit, cassis, blackberry fruit, is really what we're wanting to define the fruit characteristics of Jordan Cabernet. We've continued to stay in Alexander Valley because it does get this nice, wonderful blackberry fruit char characteristic, but we've increased our hillside percentages quite a bit. Uh, we're now uh, upwards, uh, almost 60% 60, 60 hillside. I, I think the hallmark attribute of what Jordan Wine is about is the consistency, regardless of the vintage. When you're at a restaurant or you're at your home and you open up a bottle of Jordan Wine, what you'll see is the, really the forward fruit characteristics, but overall balance, the delicious quality of this wine, that not one singular thing is really sticking out. This this unctuous character that is in the mouth, that rolls in the back, and then from a sales point of view, I think one of the key elements of our wine is, is what I think the most important component in the wine. It, it's the memory, and the memory is really focused on the, on the finish. The finish is what you wake up the next morning tasting and thinking all those sensory attributes are, are all of a sudden in memory cells, and when you wake up, you think, God, that was a great experience.